them. Oh, he's losing her matches. find out, I don't know. My poor Roger. He's so frightened. He's still up there. I've been calling him, but he won't budge. Great brute of an Alsatian. It's no wonder, is it? Uh, the call was for a cat, Mrs. Tibbs. Are you saying there's an Alsatian up there? Hey? Oh, don't be daft. I meant the dog frightened him up there. How am I going to get an Alsatian up my chimney? Why? Do you want one? No, I do not. I wouldn't mind putting a rocket up that one, though. Oh. Uh, you could always report the dog if it's out of control. Oh, it's out of control, all right. Right, let's have a look, then. He's called Roger, is he? No, Roger's up there looking for him, Jeff. You can't miss him. He's got a great big dog with him. Yeah, he's here. I can see him. Doesn't look too happy, though. Oh, God. Get him out. I can't bear it. Don't worry. We'll get him out. Can you reach him, Jeff? No. No, he's too high. He's, he's at the bend. Come on, Roger. Come on, boy. Thanks, Jim. You must have said something, Billy. We get locked in for five minutes, next I hear about it, I'm having a breakdown. Now, where's that come from? I don't know, but it's not me, I'm telling you. I thought you was a bit jumpy in there, yeah. I said that when we was in there. I didn't come out yelling loopy, though, did I? Who do you think I am, Poison Pierce? I told you, I don't like being shut in. Wouldn't have happened in the first place if Signal had been awake. Yeah, if you like. It weren't my fault either way, was it? No, you're right, it wasn't. Stupid of me letting it happen in the first place. Firefighter getting locked in on a fire ground. <laughs> yeah, it was a bit silly, wasn't it? Lucky it didn't get any worse. Yeah, well... I don't like being lectured to, that's all. Let's forget about it, shall we? Suits me, sub. I already had. Go on then, off you go. Come on, Roger. He's just sitting there staring at us. I can't shove him off. He, he's too far up. Why don't we turn those on him, Gov? Oh, she'd love that. We'll be here all night cleaning up. It'll starve to death if we don't talk him down soon. Well done, Rico. We're dumber than the cat. Before your time, wasn't it? There was a big warehouse shout about three years back. Buried off the watch before it was over. I wish I'd have known this before we got locked in. Could have calmed him down. What about you? Me? I got lucky. It was a sub and bailiff got it worst. Morning before they dug him out. I guess, um, I guess it just spooks him sometimes. And you just happen to be there. 
Yeah, it did look a bit spooky. Not like he was frightened or anything. Just nervous. Bailey ain't like it, though, is he? Well, he was out cold under it all. John was awake all night. That'd spook anyone, mate. Yeah, it would do, wouldn't it? I wish I'd have kept my mouth shut now. <laughs> You'd have had to be out cold for that, wouldn't you? What do you think? Can't but try it. Whoa. That'd drive me off further if that was me. Do you mind? That's his favourite. He loves that. Right. Plan B. Come on, Roger. Din dins. Roger. 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 Come on, Roger. Roger. Come on, Roger. Din dins. Come on, Roger. Come on, Roger. Nice one, Gov. Oh, there we go, sir. That did it. Well done. to do with him looking like that. Stick him in the washing machine, love. 